Hey guys, welcome back to Daily Duel. So today is Monday, that means we will be using Madolches, and Lunar's not here. He was busy, and he couldn't join me, so it's actually gonna be a day where I'm just gonna be using the Madolches by myself. So, oh well, we can do this. And we're going up against Slight Tour and Skill is Trash! Yeah! <laughs> so, this is actually something I wanted to ask you guys before I got the video really started. What the hell did he add? He added Lumina? Okay. The thing that I wanted to ask you guys is, um, what do you guys think about, you know, the whole intro sequence? You know, oh, fucking Soul Charge. God, I hate that piece of shit card. The card should never exist, and yet it does. It doesn't make any fucking sense. The thing is, I can I can go ham. I can go harder than a motherfucker. I can make tiramisu and everything, but the problem is, why? <laughs> Ah, fuck it. If it push on the shop, I can always make another tiramisu, but this is a bad matchup. This is a terrible, terrible matchup. Terrible matchup. I'm gonna go ahead and summon you. You go ahead and use your damn effect. Trippy, you get hoo cake. Yeah, bad matchup. That's not really good against aggressive ass decks. I'll just go ahead and summon Hoot Hoot. Go ahead and Hoot Hoot. Banish on Jelly. Go ahead and give me my... Uh... Yeah. Summon my Misen Gelato. To tell you the truth, I really don't feel like really overextended. What I was going to ask you was my intro. About the intro. Uh, what do you guys think of it? You know? Do you guys find it interesting, that you guys find it annoying, uh, I was thinking about maybe just stop doing it, you know? You know, uh, you know, uh, RJP0 did a, a video about intro videos and about how, you know, they really don't do what they were set after to do, you know, and mine's generic, you know, I did it with Windows Movie Maker, I'm not, in, I'm not an editor, I'm not, you know, have great-ass editing skills, so, you know, I'm not completely sure if, you know, I did that if I did really well, 100%, so, you know, I'm just thinking about maybe just stop doing it, you know, I'm getting my point across, I mean, of course I want you to like, comment, and subscribe, and that is not what everybody wants you to do, so by having the intro, it's kind of redundant, and, you know, I know maybe some of you guys don't watch it, maybe you guys just skip right by it, 10 seconds, but still, you know, I would love to make these two into something, and then summon this back, but my problem with it is, is that I don't want to go into, uh, I don't want to go into Tiramisu. It's fucking, it's fucking light sword, this fucking skill is trash. I gotta pretty much figure out how to beat this opponent before he can whip out Judgment Dragon and fucking stick his dick in my butt. Because that's what fucking light swords do, fucking skill is trash. I swear to God, everybody and their mother is jumping on this goddamn deck. Everybody and their mother! It's Light Swords. If Light Swords were good, don't you think they'd be played more often? But no, as soon as they got a little bit of su fucking support that really doesn't help the deck with its major problems, people still want to play that shit. So what, you're gonna go into fucking Michael? Yep. Shocked? Shocked that he went into Michael? No, that's fine. going against light swords because it's not even a duel, it's like a race against time. It's like a fucking race against time. That was a beautiful mill. 
No, oh, there's another missing gelato, because I totally wanted to draw him. Alright. It's time to do my duties. Yep. Go ahead and just summon a jelly. Jelly fucking tribute yourself, ball. We'll go ahead and just summon the level 3, I really don't give a shit. Yeah, we just need level 3 on the field, and a monster engraved, that's all we need. And so once that's, once that's nice and handled, we can continue going off with our plays, so... I'll go ahead and summon back you, Messing Gelato. Even though I drew one of you, which you never want to draw Messing Gelato, he's like the worst card to draw. So we will go ahead and get me... My other chateau. You decide to be a dick. You can get rid of my fucking chateau. So we'll go ahead and uh the thing is I kinda want uh what's it called? Uh ticket. So it's pretty much a race against the opponent. I mean, I'm totally glad and thankful that he was actually playing, paying life points himself, because, you know, you know, that makes it easier for me to handle this duel. Alright. I can only use the effect of... Or is the effect negated? Oh, I don't have a beast on the field. I do not have a beast on the field. That is correct. Alright. We'll go for the bottom bitch herself. Put you, put you two back. Thank you for assisting me. What, you want to play Valor now? Go ahead and play it. No, 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 no. I already got one message out of my hand. I don't need two. Alright, well, he'll survive. He will survive because he does have one Necrogardner right there, so he will survive. So that's good for him. He's lucky. He's lucky that he milled a Necrogardner. And this, see, this is the reason why I don't like Light Swan. That's pretty much all you gotta say against this deck. He's lucky that he got a Necro milled a Necrogardner. He's lucky that he, he got JD. He's lucky, he's lucky, he's lucky. There's no real skill involved. That's why I call this deck skill as trash. You know, you could be the skill, most skilled duelist in the goddamn world. And, you know, luck is always going to be a factor with Light Sworn, so. Especially Light Sworn that play this piece of shit card. This deck doesn't seem like a deck that would like to play Soul Charge. That's thousands and thousands of life points that you're, you're losing. No. Are you gonna drop honest? There it is. So this whole time I was just going around his monster, he sat there with honest in his hand, he's like, oh! Oh! Watch him mill a fucking gardener. Nope. Nope, I'm not seeing any gardeners or anything along those lines. Nope, nope, nope. So, <clears throat> I would just be winning this duel. I'm just summon you. I just activate Book of Moon. Sit you down. Volker run over your goddamn monster, and then fucking Western Gelato go for the game, so. so this wasn't even the duel, this is a race against time. And I won the race. GG, Light Sword player. Yeah, Soul Charge and Light Swords, you're already paying a huge chunk of life points to do JD plays and Michael plays. You don't have much defense, so you're taking some hits. You really think you want to play Soul Charge as well? Eh, <laughs> to each is their own. We'll get one more duel in. Be back. Alright, we're back. So, you know, with Angeli being a ultra rare, 
How much do you guys think that card's gonna cost? I'm thinking... Oh, I'm going first? Oh, sure. I'll go first. Setup is important. You can have your fucking extra draw. I'd rather be set up. I'd say maybe 40, 50, depending on how hype, overhyped the deck is. So. Angelis, I mean, Angelis. But Dotes are going to be a pretty expensive deck. I mean, they're still not even one of my upper favorite decks, swear to God, they're not. My problem is that they don't have any bite during your opponent's turn. Yeah, whether I have, you know, Magilly on the field or, you know, Tiramisu on the field. You know, he can just go off with his blaze, and I really don't got a response with that, you know? So, that's my problem with Odoche, is they don't have any threat during your opponent's turn. Yet they're not aggressive enough to be, you know, in that position. But that's just my opinion. You know. They may be nice and cutesy. They'll, they'll be able to duel and put up a good challenge against aggressive decks. Aggressive decks will probably get beat by... By... Uh, by... Uh, by Magellines. By, by Magellines. I saw the Magellines, I said by Magellines. By Madoches. But, you know, control decks... Control decks are going to laugh in their face. They're going to be like, wow, alright, that's it? That's all you got. Alright, well, I'm, I'm just going to, you know... Win? Winning? Is that okay? Winning? Charlie Sheen style winning. So, yeah, just not a big fan of decks like this. I need a little bit of bite during my opponent's turn. There's a reason why Pleiades is scary. I don't care if my attack goes down, I'm going to be tributing you anyway, so. So we'll summon our little Alga. I'm liking riding Captain deck, like, if I would ever make the real life Madocha deck with Angeli and everything, I would definitely be running, uh, riding Captain. Because it's pretty much another kitty cat. It pretty much serves the exact same purpose as the kitty cat does. Go ahead and summon Levier, not not Invoker. I mean, this deck is super super aggressive. It can, it can it can do some two really good plays. Like, look, I'm doing this with a two card combo. I'm just going off. I'm just going ham right now. So, you know, I'm just going fucking kosher on this shit. So we'll go ahead and make you. Uh, yeah, you too. Go ahead and activate you. Uh, we'll put Angeli back. Put Angeli back to my hand. Oh! Put that back in your deck. And uh, do I want another piece to the combo? Hell yeah! Give me the kitty cat. Uh, nope. Put it in my hand. Nope, nope, nope. So I can make another tiramisu next turn. I am up on resources. You're four, and I'm one. Well, look at the thing with continuous spells, they count. They count as a neg. They don't count as you know anything. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Go ahead. I don't think I play 82 in the extra deck. Nope, I didn't. Should be in here. Take out Diamond Dire. Play that shit. Diamond Dire pretty much got became obsolete in comparison to uh uh ch 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 X X ton. So yeah. Ah, uh, well you're lucky. I don't have any Madoches in my graveyard right now. I mean, I could do some plays. Yeah. Uh, is there any threes I could just detach? Yeah, 
got this. I got this. I'm just gonna make him Dolker. Not because I want to summon Messon Gelato or anything. I, I, have, I don't give a shit about summoning Messon Gelato. The only thing I give a shit about is getting that fucking Madoje to the graveyard. That's all I care about. No fucks are given to summoning him. I don't give a shit about that. Now since I got a Madoje in the graveyard, you two can go back and. No, go back to the deck. I don't want you in my hand. Tiramisu does not target, so go back to the deck and that's game. So I'm glad I got to go fucking ham on your ass and make that shit co kosher. Game. That was easy. Alright. I'm actually gonna call this a short one because I actually gotta get ready for class. Yeah, this early Monday morning I got class, so I apologize that I couldn't get one more duel in, but like I said, I gotta go. I also gotta record for Tuesday, so when I get back, so. Thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with Bujins. Thanks for watching.